War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself, for my wife, for my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Hey everyone, this is Freak. Uh, it's been a while. I've been playing Fallout 4 for a couple weeks now, and I've been wanting to make a playthrough video for you guys, but... I mean, I put in 30 plus hours into my initial game, and I hadn't even got to Diamond City yet. Uh, for those of you that know, Diamond City is one of the first areas that you're told to go to, and for me not to get there by 30 hours, I find that would be the most boring playthrough to watch, and if I did try to edit it, just to make it uh, more streamlined towards the story missions, I think it would be just be choppy as. So what I've done instead is I've restarted the game, and I'm going to mod it, and I'm going to cheat a bit. The cheats aren't to make me like a god, although I am pretty godly with them. Uh, it's mainly so I can unlock the weapons, uh, all the perks, all the special, and also enhance the game's appearance a bit. Now, people are going to go, oh, you've just taken away from the whole game. In a way, I have, uh, because I'm not going to be looting everyone for everything that they've got, uh, worrying about adhesive, what breaks down the copper glass to make modifications to my weapons. Instead, I've already got those weapons modded how I want, so instead of watching me go through a game, killing people, then looting them, killing people, then looting them, searching through every box for every bit of scrap, now you're just going to see me play the game start to finish, go through story missions, uh, side missions that I find along the way that might interest me, and I think that'll be more enjoyable to watch because who wants to watch 30 hours of me constantly, constantly looting everyone and then going back to uh, Sanctuary, dumping all my stuff for all the components, selling off all the junk, making sure that I've got enough carry weight, then going out again and doing this again for 30 hours. Nobody wants to watch that. Hun? I'll just be a minute. Ah, good morning, Mum. Thanks, Codsworth. Grognak the Barbarian and the Jungle of the Bat Babies. <laughs> Sugar bombs. 
100% daily value of sugar. I know we were nervous at first, but I'm glad we got Codsworth. Now who left those here? It's a little early to be drinking. Hey, hun. Do I look nervous? I look nervous, don't I? Salesman again. Saddle up Salisbury steak. Graded A plus. Good morning. Voltec calling. No offense, but no soliciting. Oh, no worries, ma'am. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not today. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No, oh. <clears throat> you do. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being um, <laughs> a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Uh, just go away. Won't take but a moment. We do need to verify some information to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of <coughs> total atomic annihilation. The apocalypse? Well, hell, sign me up. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. Now, let's see. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. This trilogy, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to call me now. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? Miss Trinity, if I may, Sean requires your personal attention. A little motherly love to quiet the nerves. My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey. I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? That's my boy, on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Oh, right. A park. With you. Because I want to get pregnant again. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes. Blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get Codsworth? confirmation. Mom? We seem this to have lost contact with what our fleet stations. 
aircraft coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. We need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. So basically, I've just uh, made up a lot of excuses why I think that I should be allowed to cheat. And... <laughs> And you guys can ride me for that, for all it's worth, because I am cheating. Yeah. But it's meant for your enjoyment. It's meant to make this a lot more enjoyable to watch. So, uh, whatever. That's absurd! I am Not on the list. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't shot me! Oh, 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 okay, okay. I ripped out the whole program. If you're in the program, oh, we need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, sir. Follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside the gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Step on the platform in the center. Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! Hold on! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I've also added a lot of tiny mods that won't mean much. Uh, these are like adjusting the player's teeth because when you're first making the female character her teeth are rank uh, I don't know what went wrong there but they just look dirty they look small decrepit and I just made a better teeth mod um, better eyes a black assault gas mask now I'm not even gonna use the gas mask that much but it looks fucking sick so I downloaded that we'll get everyone situated in your new home Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... Oh, no, no, we don't. Don't this get caught up thinking you. about that. You're, You're safe now. This way. Female. In an Male and This one is good. Step over to the table. Take a suit. This way, You'll please. need your suits Welcome. before we can okay. take you further. Pick up a suit right over there. Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? No, just this way. This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is Don't one of our most advanced our facilities. Home. Everything. Not that have. the others aren't great, Mother mind you. Father down in DC. Oh God, honey. What if they How long make do you it? think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. The vault suit is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? S excuse me. Step into the chamber It'll be okay. whenever you're ready. Mommy's right here. See? Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three. This is 
the one here. Open it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. Giant roaches? What the hell? pin. Yes. Perfect.
my god. They did it. All that fighting, and for what? Everything's dead. Everything's dead? Ah, yes, uh, the garden. Uh, the posies have been problematic, I admit. If only Sir were here to help. Where is he, by the by? They... They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you'll need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. <laughs> is, is the lad uh, with you? Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Uh, why, uh, why, sir, had him last, remember? Perhaps he's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure he'll be back with him momentarily. Sean's been kidnapped. I'm gonna find him. I'm gonna get my baby back. It's worse than I thought. Hmm? You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you sure? A bit over 210, actually, Mum. It'll take a little for the Earth's rotation and some... Minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mum, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. <laughs> and the car, the car! How do you polish rust? Stop it. Get to the point. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. I, I did find this holotape. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. <laughs> What's all this? in another house. Follow me. Picking up hostile peekaboo.
Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, Mum. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. I like these people already. Oh, good. Maybe you'll get along there, and they can help you find young Sean. I shall remain here and secure the home. 